Holding cold aces, private flight, skip the line, man, it's no waiting, no waitress, flight out to Las Vegas, lost wages, stewardess, vanilla wafers, Caucasian, briefcase money like I'm Caucasian, a boy I watch you tell her moon, yo, now that's I'm mucho, more than time she moon, bro, let me hit Ray Mundo, when I'm sitting up high, yo. Euro man, and I'm repping that flight club experience, man. Where it's no cap recap, but not just me, man. I got my co pilot, man. How you feeling, OG? I'm feeling blessed always, and you know it's OG need a grade. Ooh, she see the you see saw the fingers snapping and tapping, man. She got, <laughs> got her nails done, and it's oh, I like that, man. She coming out feng shui, but not not just only that, man. Man, OG man, we got we got a, a special interview, man. Mm -hmm. This guy right here is an artist, man. That. He puts on a hell of a show and he likes to record it. He a funny motherfucker, by the way, man. So I want to I want to introduce man to the world forever, forever, ever, forever, ever, forever. Blade, man, welcome to the motherfucking party. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Thank you for having me. Hi, man. Thank you for having me, Blade. Of course. So, Gensu Blade, Forever Blade, Three Way Blade. What's your real name? Damn, the government? No, not that one. Oh, I can say it. No, oh, not that one. I don't do that. I don't do that. Don't do that. Right. So, my I stage name is Three Way Blay. Okay, Three Way Blay. Uh, you know, my, all my other handles are uh, Forever Blay. You know, mm -hmm. call me what you want. Just can't come. Give us wrong. the socials. Give us the socials. So, all my, uh, all my um, I have Instagram, Twitter. Everything, okay. everything, you know, is Forever Blay. F-O-R-E-V-E-R-B-L-E -E -E underscore at the end. You feel me? Easy style, follow me. All the music is under three way blade though, so you know. Yeah, man. Tap in. So well, how you come up with that name? Like how you come up with uh the what like the blade? Like I call you Gensu Blade because you raise razor sharp when I when you hit the stage. So tight, tight, I'm trying tight, to figure tight, out tight. how you came up with your name. I know how I came up with my nickname. Right. Yeah, I mean so it was around the time when like Young Thug was popping, like early okay. like, 2014, 15 type shit. So, you know, he was replacing all the C's with B's. Okay. So I used to be telling like, I used to be telling I used to go to tech, so I used to have like, you know, a big friend group, or whatever, and then like, you know, everybody was trying to be funny and then it was like my name was Clay, but they said Blay. I get it. Oh, I like that. And, and, and like then when that. the girls say it, it sounds way better when the girls say it, so that's just like it was just sticking it. How they say it, how they say it? Blay. Oh you like that, you like that. Sound, yeah, that shit sound hard, bro. I tell you, that shit sound hard. I like that. I like women. Yeah. And then the three-way was just from the middle man. <laughs> of course lesbian. you do. He's a lesbian. <laughs> Y'all didn't know I'm a proud lesbian. Um, proudly, I love women. And women say they love me, so I don't, I don't think they're lesbian, but we both like what we like. Anyway, um, three-way play. Oof, I'm a three-way nigga. Um, I like threes companies um <laughs> but fuck all that man your energy man i love your energy man fuck all that man your energy bro like i've never seen you if i did see you have a bad day i've never seen you outside having it like i never see you in a crowd like damn man, i really don't you know. never see it on his face yeah like your energy man talk about protecting your peace and protecting your vibe man like talk about that because i feel like Word. you're doing very very well yo honestly i'm still trying to master all that i'm not even gonna lie it's really like mm -hmm. a um a self-awareness thing. I think we all are. Yeah, that's a fact. So, I feel like, like, I'm a type of person, like, not even, like, bragging. Because, you know, you're always the same way. We're the type to walk in the room, and we can really shift the whole, mm -hmm. the whole yeah. you know what I mean? So, yeah. I noticed even at my jobs, bro, like, I'll be upset. And then, like, go in the room, and everybody just start acting weird. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like, not even towards me, just towards each other. It's like you just bringing in, like... You feel like your energy is affecting it's, it's that it's strong. Like, you feel like your energy is that strong. It's like bringing out a virus when I'm, when I'm upset. You know what I mean? It's like making everybody sick now. Like, it just, you feel me? So, Ooh, I just like So, the, you can't be like that. And like, I just try to be the bouncy one and want to stay up. You know what I mean? Because I know, I never know who's going to do what. And, like... Um. Making people smile and stuff. That's, that's, that's my only goal is make people happy and smile as much they, as I can. They say the people that try the most to make other people happy tend Go to die. Go through them. Nah, yeah. You know what I mean? That's so, a fact. That's so a fact. When, it, when, when it's time for you to pick yourself up, do you get a Kit Kat? Like, or do you like, <laughs> how do you give me a break? Like, how do you just like get through that, that tough time? And what, do you, what, what mindset do you go to? Like, 
you know, I'm still trying to figure out more hobbies other than music. So right now, I just like, you know, oh, my father's the same way, but he, we, we, we work. We like to work. So right, right, right. Okay. I'll, either, I'll, work, I'll go to my job and just try to get that whole, you know what I mean? Work, focus that whole day on this and the positive and focus on what I have. Mm-hmm. And it's like a job. I'm going to get a check. And other people got it worse. Right. So, it, or I either make a song. Or just hang around people I like to hang around with. You know? yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I have like a lot of intellectual friends we can sit and talk about like, stuff other than people. You know what I mean? So that's important I'm things. Yeah. Important other than the bullshit. Yeah, mental stuff, all that stuff. Like, cause I don't like sitting around talking about people and shit like that. I feel like that's very low vibrational. <laughs> it I like is. Like low vibe plates though. They're awesome. Gossip. That is a crazy term. They're awesome. <laughs> <laughs> like I like starches. I like I'm a you know I like what? gluten. I'm a side nigga. For all those side niggas out there, I like a whole plate full of sides. Don't be giving me no green shit. I want mac and cheese, rice, the whole Zagna. I want everything on the side of the like a whole plate of sides. I'm a side nigga. Yes, Damn, the side. Cabbage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Macaroni. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Two times. Yeah, two sides. Yeah. I might I might double back and just make a side plate. Damn. You feel me? Like, I'm just I'm a side nigga. Oh, straight sides. Straight sides. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? What kind what type, what type of nigga are you? Uh, what you mean, like you a main nigga on side? Yeah. No, I'm a main. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> you just gotta even make that. You just gotta even make that. Yeah, like, that's like, the fact that like, this, 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 and why? Yeah, first you want all of that? You want all of that woman, or you want just like a piece? Like that's what he has. I want the whole enchilada. Sweet. I'm not the type that really be like, enchilada. Yeah, right. I'm, not, I'm not the type of nigga. Enchilada. Like, I don't really like. I, I don't really like juggling. I can't really juggle. So you you couldn't be like in a circus and juggle. Yeah. Too many girls come with so many problems. Yeah, that's yeah, and a lot of people aren't like. Cause I, I had a baby with this young lady for like a reason. You know Damn, I mean? the nigga said young lady. All right, I'm gonna stop. You feel me? I had a baby with her for a reason. It's like you don't Yo, come across that. Nigga said young lady. Like, not all the time. My baby like, mother. A lot of people. Mindsets, that, females' mindsets are crazy. Bro. I don't really. Oh, it's not bro. attracted to me. So I don't really indulge in it. Damn. What like too many women? Mm-hmm. Yeah, like especially. Well, I'm judging from like my like from where I'm from right now. Cause I haven't really explored everywhere. I haven't really well, stayed. Where you from? Now I'm from Patterson, where you are, right? Patterson, New Jersey, bro. Mm-hmm. Yeah, my presidential, bro. Come yeah, Thotty. Come on now. Thotty. <laughs> the Love No Thotty crew. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, we got a newspaper called Thotty Times, but um, that's hard. Fucking all right. So you 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 you're not you're you're not okay. You're you're okay with being the main nigga, but you. You, you, you're not okay with being a side nigga. No, that side shit is too much. Cause you know, okay. everybody, baby father, the boyfriend, crazy. Right. Now it's time to listen if I mess with you. You got somebody already. And right. it's like, I don't want to get into that. You're like, what the hell? Like, so is anybody truly single? People are definitely truly single. Yeah, honestly, yeah. Somebody yeah. was in that shit before you hopped in. I feel like, like it was months away or a day. That's a fact, but I'm saying <laughs> I was before. I think everybody do it. I, don't know. I think everybody do it. Yeah, yeah, I think like, everybody, everybody. Well, you know, dating is a real is. thing. Dating is a real thing. So. Dating is a real thing. That's a fact. I was but. dating with, in music because you're, you're a musician. As an you artist, you don't understand oh. how hard that is to have Damn. a big booty bitch twerk in front of your face and your girlfriend call you like, uh uh-uh, uh, I know what you're doing. It's or like, your this girlfriend. is just for the job, baby. She's not twerking for fun. She's twerking for fun. Or your girlfriend, <laughs> or your girlfriend is right beside you while you at the show, and somebody mm. just they lead, they 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 throwing themselves on you. Mm. Like how is that way? Mm. Don't be smiling too hard at that. But yeah, so how's 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 love, <laughs> love and hip hop? Honestly, bro, I'm right. trying to I be trying to talk to the to the to the to whoever. You know what I mean? Like I be trying to talk to her if anything. Like let her know, like yo. You like me for a reason. You seen my gram, you was attracted to me for a reason. You feel me? I don't think no woman on this earth likes any man who don't get girls. Now, I'm not saying that I take that to, to like, oh, okay, I can just talk to any girl in, in front of you or whatever, like behind your back, but it's just like, all right, shows and stuff like that, you got to understand that, like, yeah, this is how it go. Like, you know how this go. Like, you can either get with it or you don't. Like, you got to trust that I... You put your pimp in now, okay? Yeah, because you got to respect that I know better. And I do know better. I do what you I want. You value yourself. Yeah, I do what I want. But I don't, that, don't, that doesn't mean I want to do the wrong thing. You know what I mean? Okay. Like, okay. I want to do the right thing. Okay, that's, right. that's my thing about it. So yeah. she knew who she was getting yeah, with when she, started get, when she started trying to get with you. And it was, it, was, it was problems. Of course, it was definitely problems because it was like, oh, because I'm talking to females a certain way, being too nice, whatever, whatever. And I get it. But I'm like, yo, 
If I gotta use my looks to get my way, I'ma do that. And you shall not be in my video. Hey, hey yo, Papa John. I'm, I'm gonna pay so you. You're watching like Maury, and the girls is like, we gotta use what we got to get what we want. You was a thotty ass. Nigga. Yeah, you know that's the thot shit. You was a thot. Hey, you was a thotless. <laughs> you was a baby <laughs> thot. You was a thotler. You was a thotler. Oh man, now I can fuck with my dog, man. At the end of the day, man, he could he could take a joke. He got great intelligence, and he know how to communicate. So. I fuck with people that fuck with them. Um, end of the day, man, you got this studio, that studio, you got these people, you got you got a lot going on with just one with one per to be one man. Like yeah. how do you keep putting on all these hats? You're a father, you um you single. No. Nah. No? No. Nah. I tried. Um <laughs> I, I didn't know who was watching, but you know. I guess white people watch. Um, <laughs> so you're not single, eh? No. Okay, so how was that? Great. It's great. Fucking awesome. Is it easy having a relationship and being in this industry? No. I mean, like I said, you're right, on it. What's some of the problems that come arise? Like, what's the main three? Females. Females and females. Females, women, and girls. I like that. <laughs> I like that. Females, women, and girls. No okay. You just gotta re give her reassurance. That's all I really be trying. You know? Let her know, no matter what, baby, you're the one. That's yeah, all. That's, it all so that's it. It's gonna be so simple. It's called reassurance. It's called reassurance. All these girls get my DM and, 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 and don't it don't matter. matter. Baby, no, you the one. Yeah. This is you, it's you, not gonna be so simple. It's the image. Exactly. It's the image. It it's like Future don't do all the drugs, but you would think you would he do all does. That's like what he's saying. Yeah, so it's the image I'm selling. It works. It works. I don't care. Nobody say it works. Okay. Okay. <laughs> it works. So speaking of uh, influence and under it, your style ain't uh, too orthodox. So who influ Like who's your one? Give me a dream collab. And who influenced your style to 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 make you even fall in love with hip hop? To even try it. Man, that's crazy. So, growing up, I listened to like a me being me. I listened to a lot of soft rock and like uh, R and B music. I that like makes that. Nice I like yo, that. It, yo, your style. It makes style a lot of it. sense because it it does give like you know a different type of other it's than just the regular yeah. rap. Yeah. I, I, mean, I listen to some of your music. You did? Yeah, I did. Oh, thank you. You like it? I do. It's giving me. I don't like to compare artists, but. I mean, it, I feel like it's a compliment. Yeah. It's giving a little bit of say? like Lil Uzi. <laughs> <laughs> and she said a little twice. She said it's giving a little like Lil Uzi. Uh, it's, so the like the, it's, it's the vibe though. It's the vibe. It's the vibe and it's the aura. And I like it. I like it. It's different. It's 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 like outside the box. Thank you, Rory. That's what I was trying to go for. Man. I love it. I'm glad it's working out because, you know, I thought he wasn't picking up on what I was trying to do. No. But yeah, so I used to listen to a lot of that in my own world. But then, like, around me would be, like, a lot of old school. Like, on my mother's side, would be a lot of old school R&B and cookouts and stuff like that. So, mm -hmm. like, and then on my father's side, I used to listen to, like, a lot of... Um, he used to have like a lot of uh, New York underground mixtapes, mm -hmm. like Rick Ross and OJ Juice Man. All this other shit I did not absorb yeah, when I was younger. Was listening to OJ. He Juice was wild, like he Juice. had mad, bro. He had mad mixtapes, like okay. just okay. Music. Okay. I'm just yeah. like, damn. I'm like, yeah, I don't like this song. I don't like this music. I'm I was not like, I'm busting. That's not so why I'm so like, after a while, I started figuring it out. Like, oh, this shit is fly. Like, it's fly nigga shit. I get it. Like, but um, you ever seen the dunk? On 26. On 26. <laughs> <laughs> nigga. Bro, it changed your life. Nigga, I got my go for my first gold grill like that a week later. Nigga. Yeah, I, like, I heard a brown paper bag. Like, nigga, what? I, I first heard a brown paper bag. I was geeking. I'm like, for that. Brown paper bag. Brown paper bag. Brown paper bag. Brown paper bag. I feel like that was, that that was super human yeah. trap music. Like, that Rick <laughs> like if you was like in super <laughs> Like you were, you were not a regular trucker. You was a super. <laughs> you got that brown paper bag. <laughs> and it's kind of like a, it's kind of like a cape. You got a cape full of uh, brown paper bags. You look like a textbook on the back. <laughs> Who's on that track? They, they had C Pain, Rick Ross. That was a legendary track. Hey, who? Yeah. <laughs> That's what I was going to say. Ace Hood! <laughs> that brings me to my next point. That was one of my influences. Ace Hood? I'm about to say Ace Hood? Ace Hood! <laughs> hey, yo, I ain't going to lie. That hustle oh. hard. I, I drove all the way to Atlanta off that shit. Hustle. 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 H
The remix? 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 Go ahead. Go ahead. Same over there. It's a different day. Damn, I like yo man, I like that. You culture, so not only yeah, are you yeah. a rock and roller, but you know a little about the trap too. I like that, man. Yeah, you like a, a rock trap, a trap rock. Tower. Somebody called me a surfer, and uh, they said I surfed through the exits in the, in the towers. I can see that. <laughs> they said I, I can surf, see that. I got like surfboard music. Nah, <laughs> for real. Surfing the crackheads in the, in the exits. Like your music is mad, like. I feel like mad. Anim- I feel like mad anime uh, cartoons could be made to it. Yeah. As they say fact. hello to my little friend. You talking hey. about guns? I bet. Remember Country Grammar? Hey. I'm going down, down, baby. Yo, street in the Range Rover, street, street, little bit. But you right. thought he was saying some like Teletubby shit. Facts. Yeah. He was talking about laying that. shit down. This nigga said, say hello to my little friend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Her yeah. initials F and then run up, you gonna see your ass. So and how are you like so jolly man. rancher with a gun? You gotta ask, uh, you gotta <laughs> <laughs> I like this shit. Bro. I like this. Don't look at me! I like this. <laughs> <laughs> I've been drinking. I've been thinking. Yo, balls, it's making some sense to me right now. Oh so explain God, it. No one explain it. Like, I don't know, bro. I'm heavily influenced by like T Pain and like Lil Wayne and shit like that, bro. So, what was T Pain? Best album to you? Um, the the one with Bartender. And, and I like the from, ball. Yeah. Yeah. She and what's the other one he said? I'm in love with a stripper. I'm in love she with a stripper. She popped, she rolled. I ain't trying to wear a boy. I'm in love with that stripper. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, I, yeah, I had my man. first uh She can pop it, she can lock it. In Tampa. Shout out to E-Boy City, man. Yeah, yeah man. <laughs> so, I bet we got your influence. Um, I like this. We talk about relationship. We talk about your music. Um, your dream collab in the town or in the industry? Damn, we're right. I want to get with... Um, that's a good question. Mm-hmm. I know I acted. <laughs> we're... <laughs> You know it's crazy. I'm mean, <laughs> from the town. Where it does, I ain't gonna lie. From the town, dies. that's crazy. I just uh, talked to him. That's crazy because I, you know, I work with Vince. I work with Zeno and shit like that. So I'm, a, I'm like Vince. Vince. You call the niggas Vince. That's, that's his nickname in there. I don't know, but I, I know him by what, what his mama don't call him. <laughs> Z Zenuff. <laughs> that was enough. Okay. Zenuff. Okay. Him, you know, he, he always put me on game, with bro. He want me to. Um, I don't know, he been trying to click us up for a while now, but him, and then outside of that, um, I mean, I don't know, but like Neo or something like that, Neo or T-Pain or something, bro, I fuck with T-Pain. You an R&B ass nigga? Why wow, he said Neo? I'm getting older too, bro, that shit, I'm about to change the whole lane, I'm about to change the whole lane, I'm trying to tell you. I'm about to switch the whole lane up, word. Mm. When's your birthday? November 19th. Oh, you mad. Scorpio game. Growl. Yes, man. What's the uh, what's the what's the downside to being a scorpion? Uh, I like how I answered that actually. I don't know. I think it's that metaphor they use in like the uh, the stinger, you sting yourself or something like that. Oh, so y'all y'all, y'all hold y'all yourselves too? Yeah, it's like, it's like yeah, my own. What I don't, I don't your own worst enemy. Type your thing? own yeah, yeah, yeah. in a way. Yeah, yeah that's yeah, what it's yeah. basically so saying. Right? I could get real upset and then. Self destructing and like, you know, it just all fall back on me. I just hurt myself and then so. okay. But stuff like that. That's, I think honestly I think that's human though. Yeah, so that's why I'm I, I don't even really follow astrology though. That's what I'm saying. But like j- like I said, the characteristics. You still about stars aligning and you're not spiritual? That was crazy though. That was a crazy ass song. Yeah, it's crazy that. when you know somebody's song and they talk about some bullshit. And you be like, nigga, you nah, just said this song. Alright, bro. <laughs> you don't believe in this. Alright, bro. What the fuck are you talking about? My bad, my bad, my bad. What you say, bro? I bet I was being too real. What you say? I got it. Hey, man, yeah, man. I don't believe that shit either, man. Yeah, man. Fuck that shit, man. I don't believe it, man. Fuck that. Man. We some real niggas. Yo, dude. Nah, man. Like, yeah. I don't know, man. That's how so, I feel about it. So, you, you, um, you want to ask me anything about some toxic shit, or you just want to keep it book basic? Um, so, we basically. You say you have a girl. Your status, the main issue is like just other her worrying about other women. Um, do you have kids? Yeah, I have one. He's ten months right now. Is it with the woman you're with? Yes. Okay, so when the baby came in, 
to the picture? Did that change like the dynamic of your relationship? Kind of, because I was still going out, but like I was still here, of course. I was still like going out and stuff like that, trying to like do what I, do, you know, do my do my thing in a way, in a sense. But you weren't taking time off because the baby was born. Nah. No, no. I was there though. The house went on and stuff. Like, that was so like I had to. I needed. I didn't really have a job at that point either. So I was really like trying to make money and stuff like that. So you I'm felt like that was her job. No, nah, not really. Like I said, I was there, but I, you know. Damn, I don't think he put in no nah. elbows. Because it's, I don't, I don't <laughs> know. I think that man beat up at the fair to be Thanksgiving. Damn. Look, like his birthday had a party about to be <laughs> tense. <laughs> what did you say? Respond nah, nah, correctly. Nah, respectfully, I, I'm, you know, I'm still a father, bro. I wasn't, like, ducking nothing, you know what I mean? I just felt like I had to, you know, do what I do and still looking for jobs and stuff like that. And, um, and, and on top of that, we wasn't even, like, we didn't have our own place. You know what I mean? So it was, like. I'm the trying to make it happen for real. Like I need to, like you know what really? I mean. I was doing it before, and I'm just, you know what I mean. So, okay. you know, that that was another thing we had to like come to an agreement with, like like. Be I on the same page. There. Yeah, because I definitely stayed there for a number of days, but I also stepped out for a number of days. You know what I mean? So it was like stuff like that. Okay. Then when I got a job, you know, it's just a routine to work in and stuff like that, and then still trying to make shit happen. So. But when you did step out, did you feel like you could step out because she's the woman and she's supposed to take care of the kids? You so fucking toxic. No, not even. No, that's real though. But I'm saying like, no, nah, it's just like I said. <laughs> it's a real thing. A man, a man might feel comfortable enough. It's nothing wrong with no, that. No, I wouldn't. I, no, I wouldn't never leave. No, bro. I, I grew up different. <laughs> I, I wouldn't like. No. Yeah, I love my woman. You know, I don't know how to explain. I just It's not even a like. I'm saying like leave. It's just like a look. Hold things down for a couple while, of days while I go. While I go nah. Make this money. Not even do my thing, but make this money. You know, go be, on these I'm shows. Go go to the store. I'll be back. <laughs> nah, I was keeping it a thousand though. You know what's going on. You know what's going on. That I feel like that's what matters though. Only she knows what's going on. Like, cause definitely like he's he's gonna get older, and I'm definitely gotta deal with. The rest of that, more than her. Yeah. He's still half of me. He's and it's a boy. Yeah, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So I still got to... Yeah, I'm already... We, 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 we ahead with it. Okay. You know we already know what the responsibilities yeah. come. Still learning, too. Both of us. That's the thing. So I feel like... Yeah, we definitely... It, it's just a journey, bro. It's all how you make the story, bro. You just, we just writing the story right now. So. Okay. I like this, man. The story is... The story, uh, the story is good, man. It's gonna be to be continued, and when we come back, we're gonna um see what else you got in your story in your archives, man. It's, it's probably Flight Euro, man. Flight Club Experience, and I got my co-pilot. Oh, Gina Gray. And I got my dog. Forever Blaze. Forever, ever, forever, ever. <laughs> Papa John, deliver us out, baby. We'll be back. Not one, two, but three of them blades, my G. How you doing, forever, forever, ever, forever. <laughs> How you doing, man? I'm chilling, man. You know the vibes are great. I like this, man. Me, man. I don't see you getting out of pocket with anything, so I'm just gonna get you out of pocket. Wow. So random. I called it. I called it. I called it random. Random. Here we go. So this segment is called Triple C's, <laughs> aka Ricky Rose. Oh. Oh. Let me explain why it's called Triple C's, man. Because in life, man, you, you could be one of these C's, man. You could either be the cheater, you could be cheated on, or you could be the Cheeto, the side chip. I'm going to give you two options to pick, and you tell me which one were you. Now, before you answer, and before I let go, <laughs> shout out to the cookout music. I'm going to need you to think about Thanksgiving, Christmas, New Year's Eve, Anything else that come with family functions and other sides of the family before you answer? So go ahead. Triple C's, though. Cheated on. Have you ever been a cheater? Have you ever been cheated on? And have you ever been a side chip? A cheat up. <laughs> you can go ahead, my buddy. I gotta pick one. You can pick two. I like that. That's um, more toxic. I might just to say, because I definitely have been cheated on, and I have definitely been a cheater. At one point. It was like a while. It was like at one point, though, in my life. Was it... Younger. Is, was it both at the same time? No. It was just me hurt. <laughs> it was some BS. So you got cheated on and you didn't get any, get your lick back? No. I just cut her off. You but I was cheating at everybody else like shit. So. Okay. You know, the Scorpio backfires again. And then you cheated and what was the reason? I was hurt. Being just selfish. being lustful? Yeah. I'm selfish. Yeah. Same thing, right? Yeah. Definitely lustful. 
It's a lot of maturity. This is like the high school days though, you know, so I was still, Oh, this I was, was still, like what? Yeah. 20, 20, 20 what? 20, 20, 15, like before that, a little bit before that. So. Damn, you young as hell. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> my bad, I, my bad, yeah, go ahead. So 2015, you was cheating. Yeah, man. Big Cheeto or Little Cheeto? Like, ah. Nah, Little Shit, Little Shit, Little Shit, because it's the reason why everybody don't know my name, you know? So it wasn't like really. Not too crazy, but. Okay, okay. Everybody did they dirt. Did you, right, when you got cheated on, did you cry? Yeah, I was young as hell. I wasn't young as hell, but I was emotional. I was like, what? I think I was like 12, 13. I was an emotional kid growing up. I ain't gonna lie, bro. After a while, I broke out of that. cheated on in the sandbox? Bro, I was in South Carolina. I'm all the way in South Carolina. I ain't eat for like three days because of my hurt when she tired. Oh, <laughs> my God. She need to tell me. I can't sleep, oh, man. Can't tell me. <laughs> One of my homeboys. I can't eat, baby. <laughs> it's critical, bro. Yeah. It's critical. Bro, I'm all the way in South Carolina. My man's just chilling with one girl. That's your man for real? Nah, but look, hear me out, right? It was, it was <laughs> I'm him. I'm just saying, that ain't your man. It was, it was him, and he was with the one girl, right? Her cousin was, was my girl. So it's them two and my mans. And then some other dude who was there, I don't know who the fuck he was, but he was there. And he telling me, oh, I was extra shit. And then she lying about it, and it's just a whole bunch of shit. And I just fell out. Like, just like, damn, bro. Like, I don't waste my time game. Like, I don't know why I thought, like. Damn, see, Damn, bro, like, this is we was I, young, you know what I'm saying? Like, we, yeah, we was young, though, that's yeah. what I'm saying. Like, we were still been, figuring stuff been, out. Shit out. I've been all three, I've been all three, and let me tell you, man, it feels good to laugh, but it don't feel good to get laughed at. Ooh. No. It don't. I don't want to be the clown of the circus. Nobody yeah, hell be. no, don't be juggling me and Tommy and... My bad, I went deep. <laughs> I was going somewhere. I, I got triggered. Let him build, let him build. Yeah, 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 yeah you know who you are, girl. Um, <laughs> uh, speaking of you know who you are, I know you know who you are, man. So what grinds your, like, uh, 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 the unseasoned folks, shout out to the unseasoned, they might say, you know what, Billy, this really scuffs my, no. You know what, Billy, this really grinds my gears, man. And in the neighborhood, I, I, like, I like to give us our own, and I call it, what scuffs your Tim's? Cause it, 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 up north, man, you scuff somebody Tim's. That's that's almost suicide for yourself. <laughs> so what scuffs your Tim's, my brother? Uh, you know, people try to play me, uh, in the sense of like me being a good dude or me being who I am, type of person I am, and mm. other people feel like they gotta be in competition or they feel like you know threatening mm. stuff like that. Also, people who chew, like, without closing their mouth, bro. Mm. That, that <laughs> shit goes, like, <laughs> I like that. I like I the would, second answer. Bro, bro. I would put headphones head on, bro. I would literally put headphones on. That shit irks me, bro. So, you don't like the ASMRs? I, 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 want, I wish I could delete every video. I would delete every video. Yo, them motherfuckers <laughs> viral as hell. So, you're not a fan? You're not a fan? Hell no. No? I don't like to watch people eat noodles. No, not the lobster tail, none of that shit. That shit makes you sound crazy. So like, you don't like somebody like, snoring. Nah, like, no, I, I mean, I grew up, my mother used to snore, so I don't know. That's a little bit. That doesn't bother me. Are you putting my own business on there? Nah! She's not going to be the Thanksgiving turkey, though. You know what? Well, he gonna say she mama, proud he's, talking about, he's talking about grandma, mama, mama. Like, yeah, not mama. Oh, uh, man, uh, I don't think I got no other pet peeves, though. It's like, what else? You know, people people who talk, who talk, who talk too slick, man, sometimes, you know? Like, mm. Like uh, egos, mm -hmm. we all got them. We all got them, but you could really, you could maintain it. Yeah. yeah, you don't gotta be all in somebody's yeah. face with it. Yeah, like yeah. But you don't humble walk yourself. That's yeah. where that words come Such from. Now, you have an ego. You could think you're the hottest. That's nothing wrong with that. No. But also, you know, in That's the room with other people, humble yourself. That's Relax. a fact. That's a fact. Mm -hmm. I'm oh, like this. Fact. Sure, I'm like that shit, man. Your, your, your scuff on your Tim turned into a lesson. Right. I like that. Right. I like that. And we're going to do one more before we get to the uh, Flight Club freestyle and the drop. Um, I think I think we could. You got, you got, you got a random? I just kind of wanted to know, like, what was your motivation behind, like, starting music? Um, Like I said, I grew up around it a lot. Um... But what made you say that then when you went, you woke up one day and was like, "Look, I'm going in this. I'm I done got something <laughs> together. I wrote it down, or not even write it down. I got it in my mind, but I just need to sit, like express it. Like, what yeah. made you say? Like, what day was that when you just woke up and was like, "Look, I'm going to the studio. I'm gonna start going to the studio and taking this shit serious." Right when Lil Wayne did the rebirth, mm. when he did that rebirth album, because I was like, 
Damn, I was like, bro, he just, he's a whole rapper, but he just took it to a whole, like, rock level. He so always like, does. He's very versatile. And I like that type of music, so I wanted to go in there and try to do that. But then, like, before that, it was, like, a little year or two in between that, me wanting to go and me actually doing it, because one of my exes, her sister, put me on the studio, and that's when I really started recording. Oh, yeah, I did. Okay. Recording. Yeah, at uh, SEL. Shout out SEL. We're over here, so that was that. But, yeah, as far as recording for real, and, and people just gassing me up, honestly. Like, my friends and stuff, they just gassing me up. Like, you should go in, you should go in. Like, da, da. I'm like, I was always good at writing, especially, like, I used to write, like, over songs. Like, over, like, songs that were out already. I didn't really have a lot of internet. So, I would, like, sit, pause the song, play the song, pause the song, play the song, replace it with my bars, and then, like, shit like that. But, um, yeah, just That's hard. being gassed up and just wanting to, like, do do what I saw, you know, the, the others before me did. And, and that's really what I wanted to do. I don't want to be, like... It ain't about being like the star or everything, no. but it's like being like doing what I want and it's actually it can help people or it's bringing entertainment or something or changing their mood somehow, you know what I mean? That's all I really be trying to do. In like, other words, I feel like it's being inspired it's, by something yes. and then just creating your own style. I was inspired and from I'm it. Inspired. Yes. Like, yes. That's, but you, that's a fact. That's a fact. Yeah. I love that. Thank you. Very I love that. You see why she's my co pilot? She's that's a pretty fact. good at staring in the direction of the conversation. For real. Yeah, like I said, it's staring in the direction. Yeah, man, I'm good at We want to know. <laughs> know. Thank you professionally. I we professionally. We really want to know how Blake thinking. <laughs> yeah, man. Well, I know I know what he thinking right now. <laughs> what bars am I going to spit? Oh, because we want to hear him. Yeah, cause we was not letting you leave without doing this. You got to do it. Yeah, yeah. Damn, it's like not you. Hey man, no, no chill, it don't chill me. Go. Bro. Wait, bro. When I be like, hey baby mama, he called you that lady. <laughs> then he gonna start freestyling it. Hey baby, he gonna start doing some shit right in there. Hey baby, <laughs> I'm Mario. Really? What, what? I love you. I need love. <laughs> nah, nah, we gonna be right back though, man. Flight Club Freestyle coming up next, mate. Oh gee, me, how you feeling? I'm feeling blessed. I'm feeling great for being here. Like we about it. to hear some good, some good bars. Yeah, yeah, and yeah, I'm right. ready. Yeah, 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 man. You, you, you ready? You ready? You ready? Hell yeah, I'm ready, bro. Right, man. That's the real question. We Jay do. Nicole, let's take us out, man. We gonna take a flight club freestyle pause, and we gonna get right right when we come back, man. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir, man. Get your tape decks ready. Get your a tracks ready. Get your horse with the carriage ready. Get your frog ready to leap ready. Get your cat that's meowing, get your dog that's barking. Cause we got a big dog in the house, man. We got Gensu Shark. <laughs> Forever Blade. And I got my co-pilot steering this motherfucker's freestyle. Oh, Jeannie the Great. Man, I need you to hype. Hype him up, hype him up, hype him up, hype him up. He want me to scream in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll be hype to you. Oh, Jeannie the Great. I the greatest. I do it for you. Oh, Jeannie the motherfucking Great in the building, man. We got the motherfucking flight style coming up, man. Forever Blade. Forever, ever. Forever, ever. About to drop some forever bars, man. You ready, man? Uh, yes, sir. Your energy up? Oh, to the max. Your toxicity up, too? Oh. I need you to be spicy when you're talking on this. Yeah, Come on, man. I mean, you're, <laughs> you're a jerk. I know. All right, man. You about to get into this flight club freestyle, man. Jay Nicole, deliver that motherfucking heat. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I said these niggas some runner ups. I'm just gonna run it up, huh? These niggas some runner ups. I'm just gonna run it up, uh -huh. huh? Huh? Yeah, uh, yeah. These niggas some runner ups. Watch me run it up. Uh -huh. I can't see nobody running up, cause they slow as fuck. They can't roll with us, but your bitch won't roll with us. That ain't walk, that's roll with us. I'm just trying to run it up, huh? All these haters really trying to fuck the fun up. OT in the booth until the sun up. Saving every day. Dollar not for me, it's for my son. Just uh, a little extra funds. Cause uh, when I come up, best believe it'll be up to. Yeah, 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 these niggas runner ups. Uh, yeah, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Nowhere close as us. Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm straight yeah. off. I tell them, eat the dust. Uh, yeah, uh, cause where I come from, all the fiends on dust. Uh, yeah, uh, yeah, uh, you ain't built like that. Uh, uh, damn, it shit sad. Ain't ten times, yeah, huh? Uh, uh, I said, you ain't seen ten stacks. Uh, then that shit sad. Uh, I need ten times that. Okay. Hold up, these niggas some runner ups. Watch me run it up. Run it up. I can't see nobody thumbing it up. Cause they slow as fuck. Uh -huh. They can't roll with us. But your bitch won't roll with us. Okay. That ain't walk, that's roll with us. Look, I'm just trying to run it up. Okay, huh? Hate it in it. Trying to fuck the fun up. Uh -huh. OT in the booth until the sun up. Saving every dollar. Not for me, it's for my son. Uh, yeah. Just a little extra funds. Cause when I come up, best believe it'll be up. 
up to Yeah, uh, I said, uh, yeah, uh, cause best believe when I hear be up, yeah, yeah, we up. forever, blame, yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, okay, shout out to Euro, uh, shout, shout out to me, to private flight, okay, shout out to me, uh huh, and then shout out to private flight, you know, yeah, nigga, shout out to me, like, uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> my game, I don't got no game, but my game. She got cake like little bites. <laughs> Ooh, little little bites. I like those. Ah. They just I feel like the pack be finished before you really get a flavor. Oh my god. Anyway, oh I'm a big nigga. That's fat shit. That's fat nigga shit. OG Lee, how you feel about this great freestyle? I'm feeling good. You feeling good? What what line did you take away from this? When he shouted out, um, private flight, of course. <laughs> oh, I, I, mean, I like when they shout me out too. Man. I, like I like the fact that even though he was talking toxic shit, he still took about stacking up money for his son. So. Even the, even though I'm, I'm, I rap, but I love, do what I love, I still love what I love enough to put it out there to the world. So I love that, man. Shout out to you, man. You, nah, you, shout out to y'all, bro. You, I, I appreciate oh. all the, man. I appreciate that, bro. I, really do. I like, the, I like the appreciation of the appreciations, cause we appreciate. Appreciate the appreciation. We appreciate. Yeah, I appreciate Jay Nicole. You know why? <laughs> cause we doing trap cinema after we did Jay Nicole's extravaganza. And I don't know if you know what happened at Jay Nicole's extravaganza. It was extravagant. Mm -hmm. Um, but beyond that, man, November sixteenth, man, we got trap cinema. We got plenty of artists. We got podcasts coming through. We just gonna look like when NBA players and NFL players get off the game and they talk in a press conference and they talk about how they how. They, that's what we're gonna be doing at trap cinema. Mm -hmm. So that's November sixteenth, next month. I think you're a Scorpio. Yes. Yeah, get over here. I'm over 16. <laughs> November 16th, get over here, man. What you doing, man? You, you, you free? No, nah, my birthday tonight. I, no, I am free. Yeah, I'm free. My birthday the 19th, and I got something on the 17th, too. So I'm definitely free. Okay, so 17th, that means minus one is 16. Let me lit. You free! <laughs> oh, you free! I bet! So I'm going to get him booked up. I'm going to see what I can do, man, because... Uh, when it comes to this shit, I want everybody to be on the big screen, man, because music is the movie, man. We trapping out the cinema. OG Nita Great going to be there hosting with me. She's going to be my co-host. I'm going to put this show on the road. And not only are we going to have other podcasts interviewing people, we're going to have our podcast interviewing people. So, man, this is all this is all love, man. Papa John, thank you for uh, another day, another movement. Yeah. Jay Nicole, thank you for another day of being solid and just showing up and putting in the work. And, um... Zay, right? Zai. Zai? I can't, I mean, I'm going to say, <laughs> next time I see you, better be on this motherfucking show and I better have a <laughs> session with you after that because you need to be in the studio. So I'm going to just say that. And then um, forever play. Forever, ever. Forever, ever. <laughs> you live in the track, my nigga. Yeah. Yes, sir, man. What you got dropping, man, so we get up out of here, man? Uh... Not there right now. Matter of fact, I do got it. I'm you playing it. I'm playing it. Yeah, but what's coming up? I got. Oh, I'm going go with another. Yeah, what's coming up is like I got another project, probably like middle of next year. Um, we just dropped the video. I just dropped the video with Dope Revision for that song. Stick to the plan. I hit shit hard. Shit yeah. crazy. That shit going yeah. crazy right now. I ain't going yeah. Um, yeah, I dropped the mixtape uh, a few months ago called Orthodox, and yeah, just expect more music. I got mad unreleased stuff, so. The catalogs are there, we're just you know, just logging. That's it, man. We just we just logging and vlogging and styling and wow, you know what I mean? So appreciate everybody. Like I said, on all platforms, three way blay, all social media, forever blay, regular forever B L E underscore, and you know tap in. Man, tap in, so we drop in, man. Tap in the cinema, man. Forever blay, get so sharp. Choo 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 choo. OGB. We out of here, baby. We out. We out of here, Papa John. <laughs>